I grew up on uh, Leonardo da Vinci and, and then all the science fiction movies. And throughout my life, um, I had this experience that everything that I saw, and I believed in that, I was able to create. My name is Daron Merdinger. I'm the founder and CEO of Daron Aerospace. It's not a car and it's not an airplane. In my case, it's Doroni. We are really the future of traveling here. Doron in, in Hebrew is a present. It's one of the ancient words, and you know, it's a mixture of Doron and Doroni, right? It's a drone. We took a basic design of a drone it's called X4. We did it X8 motors, you know, to give more redundancies. It's quieter, it's safer, and also it looks better. The target is to make it as, as cost effective as possible. What we're doing is a semi-autonomous system. So it's so intuitive, you go forward, you go left, you go right, and if you don't know what to do, you just drop your hands off and maintain its location. You know, much like a drone. Why not use all these technologies that are already proven to be working for us for the last seven, eight, ten years? I sold my house back at uh, the beginning of it to finance the team about six years ago. We raised about 2.7 million up to today, the last 13 months. We couldn't ask for a better place to start this thing for Florida. First of all, Florida is one of the biggest, if not the biggest aviation hub. And then the weather is good. It also lets us test a uh, situation of wind and water and high temperature so we can bring a better product to the market. You see that design, it's going to be improved. It's not going to be exactly like this. It's going to look better and it'll, it'll be more effective. But the conditions will enable us to bring a safer product to the market. Uh, we started testing, start tuning it, hovering testing and, and tether testing, what we call. We already started working on the P2. Uh, the target is to get the P2 in August. The P2 will be a, a huge leap from what we're doing here. And uh, hopefully then the P3 will be the go-to-market product. I'm holding everything that by the end of 2024, we start delivering the, the, the first units. This is the, the generation of the wheel. You're still using the rubber meets the road. And you're traveling in a two-dimensional you know, way. Even if you have autonomous system, there's still, there, there's no way you can add more roads. The sky is open. How do you get to the last, it's called the last mile problem. How do you get to the last mile? And we are the last mile solution. This is the time the technology shows us that we should move ahead and we're going essentially wheelless.